My disability is spina bifida, um, which really simply put is an undergrowth in the spinal cord. I'm about 70% paralyzed from the waist down. Um, on top of that, I also um, have a malformation in my brain that caused me to have nonverbal learning disorder, which is basically like an organizational dysfunction. I actually have like a defining moment. I was walking down the hall in my residence hall and this lady stopped and looked at me and said, why are you walking like that? And just kind of like laughed in my face and it was I found it really striking that a full-grown woman was ignorant enough to literally undermine everything that I've been through in my life because I walked differently than her. It just got me thinking that it's a big societal issue that um, I'm tired of complaining about and I want to try to do something to fix it. My message is that disabled people are being kept from being successful because people have such low expectations of them. But really, if you got to know somebody with a disability, you would realize that your expectations, you know, they were too low. And that society, by um, like babying them and treating them like they're not able to do things that everybody else can, it's making it a reality for them. Okay, so one of the craziest questions I've ever gotten, it was my first day of sixth grade PE. We were doing laps around the gym. I was rolling in my wheelchair. And this girl walks up to me and she goes, so are you going to die soon? And I said, uh, I hope not. And she kept asking me what my life expectancy was and like how she's so sorry and am I in pain and just like all these things that, I mean, I know she was only in sixth grade, but that means that her parents raised her to believe that somebody with a disability has like frail health and is so fragile. And it was insulting to me that she would make that flash assumption. And even at such a young age, like it's really shocking to me. I hope they come out with a better understanding of what it's maybe like to live with, this, with a disability. Um, but above all, I hope that they feel comfortable um, helping me start the dialogue because we need to talk about these issues or else they're never gonna get fixed.